Good morning and happy Saturday. Welcome to a holiday-esque um, vlog mini series. Mini staycation. Welcome to Newport. We look like we're in the pub. We're not. <laughs> but we're not in Newport. No, no we're not down the port. We're uh, in sunny Pembrokeshire. Yes. So, um, yes. You will have seen from our little intro bit. Um, yeah, so welcome to Newport. This is our little holiday cottage for the week, isn't mm -hmm. it? Yes. Um, arrived yesterday, very chilled out evening, nothing particularly excited. Kids were up until about 10 o'clock, it was bedlam. Settle down day, wasn't it? Settle down day. So today we are off to the beach, we're off to Poppet Sands. Oh, I look really bright and white. Um, so yes, we're off to Poppet Sands for the beach for the day. And then, um, yes, yeah, so we're here with my older brother, Steph and Griff, us four, and then, um, my sister and the boys, so we're taking it in turns to cook. So we yeah. made a very nice lasagna last night, didn't yeah. we? Barbecue tonight. Barbecue tonight, and then we're out tomorrow night and stuff. So we'll take you along for yeah. the week. And see what um, we get up to. See what we get up to. So yeah, see you when we get to um, Poppet Sands. Right. Welcome to Poppet Sands. So we've made it. Pitched our place, all ready to go. Looks very nice and uh, flat around here as well. Give you a bit of a Pan. Not very good pan, but hey ho, use it more in a bit. Cool, and uh, Robin is here as well. Hello, On welcome to the beach. <laughs> welcome to Poppet Sands. Woo so, yeah, do some beachy stuff for the day. It looks very nice, quite quiet at the moment. And uh, yeah, I'll try yeah. and show you bits and pieces as we go around. Indeed. See you later. We're going happy bank holiday Monday, um, day two of holiday, and uh, we're at we're crabbing. Bear with, I'll turn the camera around. I mean, so the estuary or the parog down at the, from our house, and we're all sort of here. Hey, <laughs> and here's Erin. Oh, look, here we go. Hang on. Ooh, that's Erin's bucket. Hers is very full. Who's this fella, Liam? Crabby. Oh, oh, yeah. And, and then. Hold on. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. And there's well. Noah. And then Noah's just having, yeah, having just stopped a cannoli. Yeah, you can there's eat that. it. There's that. So, uh, yeah, we're all sort of sat on the jetty eating, having coffee. And a bit of crabbing. Mm. Look at how many. And a seal. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? Somewhere out there. As if we'd a big seal, but I wasn't quick enough on the camera. Damn it. Hello. Hello. So where are we? Still in Newport, still down by the harbour, yeah. but we're having lunch. Lunch, so I went for the white bait and chips with homemade tartar sauce. Mm. Robin's gone for chips and a cheese and onion, cheese and onion pasty, is it? Erin over <laughs> here, bibs. over here, has got chips and a sausage roll. And, and Jay. Jay has got chips and... <laughs> with coffee on. Curry oh. sauce. Oh, I'll, put, I'll put some soft music oh, over this. Done, it's got to be done. It's got to be done. <laughs> and curry sauce. Oh, come on. I'll have a dribble. So, um, so yeah, just sat around the tables. Can I have a little boat? Do you mind? Let's see in front of us. All good. Like this. Happy holidays, day three, four, three, five really. Five? Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Wow, Wednesday. I went cardigan for um, mm. a sort of coffee and a cake. And you need a cardigan as well. It is, it's, it's chilly, we're not going to lie. Erin and Liam are just there, and we'll just do a little panoramic view, shall we? So you've got the river, I think it's the river Tivy. Tivy. Oh, there's a duck, and then down there and then the castle is sort of up in the old town there so uh hey that it's gonna flood so yeah, apparently it's liable to flooding so um so, yeah, so we're gonna go for a mooch and get a coffee and a cake and um just chill out see what we can find yeah come on and if you saw the light i got a dinosaur! Uh, Liam's dinosaur from Dino Park. Um, if you've watched that vlog, he got that yesterday. So we've just um, come to coffee work, not coffee work, no, 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 no. for um, a coffee break. 
So um, I'm having a pan of raisin. It's gonna be that extra shot. Chris and Erin are on tea cake. Liam's got some little biscuits. And this is very cute. Did you want to show yours, Liam? So there's little acts of kindness left on the table. I'll take some pictures of them in case they don't focus. It says, I'm not lost, I'm just alone. If I made you smile, please take me home and share it on Facebook. So we'll share um, the links below. But yeah, Liam's got like a little sort of green crocheted flower. And then Erin, what have you got in yours? I have. Where's the little bag with the little bag? Again, if I'm not lost. It just says the same thing. Yeah, pop it, please share your Facebook. Find your Facebook random acts of crochet kindness. It's a little bag, isn't it? And then... It has No, it's hot. It's hot. Yeah, so we'll tag all that below. Afternoon all. Hello. 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 Cafe. Is it your centre cafe or something like that? So uh, yeah, I've got a bit of lunch. I look around, so um, tour us through uh, some cool queues through our lunch. Mm, let's go. So, ah. my Welsh rarebit with a couple of bits of um, bacon there. Robin has a single sharer. Let me zoom out to get it all in. <laughs> Platter there of cheese, a bit of parma ham, some of the meats, olives, hummus. Liam has. What have you got, Liam? Um, I have some peas, some fries, and my favourite, butter chips. And chicken. And then, Erin, what do you have here? Uh, my dinner. A smoked salmon and cream cheese baguette. So, uh, I'm having a Really nice service. And, uh, yeah, we'll come back to you afterwards. Ta da. Lunch. Lunch was delicious. Really, really good. If you're in Cardigan, I would definitely yeah, yeah, yeah. recommend coming to the um, oh, we, 1176 we'll restaurant. So, we've got um, a deli by there, which we picked up some cheese. And then the kitchen is just um, down that way, um, overlooking and there's a the water over that way. Stuff like that. And, um, yeah, really, really nice. So, and uh, 1176 is important because on Christmas Day 1176, the manor owner, castle owner, I don't know, apparently had like the first um, I've said but. Mm. And if you're not from Wales, Google what an I've said but is. Big thing happens on St David's Day. And also which the, is the first of March. Don't forget the back. And um, there's a reason why as well, there's very few castle ruins around here because they can't dig down. And Erin, do you know why they can't dig? Yes. Why Erin? <laughs> because there's bats underneath. Yeah. yeah. So there's bats underneath the caves and stuff like that underneath. Yeah. Underneath. Keep saying underneath. And um, yes, I can't dig down, but there's cameras and things if you go into the castle part of it um, where you can view the bats and bits and pieces of that. So yeah, it's all good. So back. lovely lunch. Um, I'm going to head back down the high street and find the car and then yeah, mosey on back to the house. Ranch. Later. Lovely, jubbly. Thanks from a, a windy St. David's. Um, I just pan round. I'm going by. Oh, thanks. So, yeah, so good morning. A uh, bit of fab day in Cardigan yesterday. Today, uh, last night, we had steak sandwiches when we got home, which was very lovely. Um, and I uh, played the family version of um, Cards Against Humanity. This morning, as I said, we're in St David's, so we're going to go on a speedboat ride, so we will take you with us, um, and then we're going to go for a little mooch around St David's, but I'll just show you the sort of uh, very lovely view, and uh, I hope it picks up, because um, the sound is a bit crazy, with the wind, I mean, and then we are going over here onto Skoma, on Ramsey Island. Is it Skoma Island or Ramsey Island? I think it's Skoma, and Liam's just fallen over. Oh, happy times. So we've made it down to the sort of little checking points and um, we're all fully now life kitted up. So adults have the bluey grey ones and then kids have the little the little ones, don't you? Yeah. I'm an airport! <laughs>
it. That's so good. I feel wind swept. My eyes are terrible. It was a uh, speedy extravaganza with nature and history and oh, just so good. The guys on it, I would 100% recommend. Yeah, yeah. Coming down to West Wales, you have to do um, a boat ride, and I would definitely what they call voyages. Voyage of voyages of discovery. Yeah, definitely go yeah. with the guys. Loads of really interesting facts. We're a bit of a nerdy family. We enjoy a bit of history, a bit of geology all the wildlife stuff, just so good. So um, yeah, so we are now heading up to St. David's. Yep. Um, probably grab some lunch, have a look around the shops, hopefully get around the cathedral and stuff. So yeah, hmm. we shall continue. Awesome start to the day. Brilliant, invigorating. So we've been around St. David's, we had a very nice lunch in the Bishop's pub, I think it yes, is. Lovely. That's very nice. And a very nice ice cream as well. So um, we've just made it down to the cathedral. Liam. <laughs> So we've just made it down to the cathedral. So we'll sort of show you around a little bit and just try and film. We won't talk very much because obviously that would be highly inappropriate. So here we go. Morning and happy Friday. Final day of the holiday. Boo. So last night, um, it was very chilled when we got back from St. David's. We, um, this is Chris, um, yeah, just had some very nice tea that Stefan Howell cooked and, um, and played more cards against humanity, which was good fun. Today, bear with, we've just come for a walk down to, um, on the Wales Coast Path. Ta -da. Hello. <laughs> yeah, so we've just done a bit of the Welsh coast path at um, Newport and then we're just down on the estuary um, on the sort of beach having a play. I just saw a huge load of geese. Um, yeah, look at some birds and kids will turn it around. Our Erin's looking for crystals, playing football. Yeah, just having a bit of a chilled um, sort of final last day. And then um, I'm not sure what we're up to this afternoon. And then we're out for dinner at the Castle Inn this evening. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah. Out to sea. I don't know if you can hear Liam um, shouting in the background, but basically the sea is just behind me there. So I'll pan round and show you where we've walked. So that's Newport. Come on up here. So we've got ourselves a coffee from there. And then basically we've gone all the way around the estuary. So basically all the way up there all the way round, down along there, and then we sort of joined the estuary just sort of here, and then we've walked all the way down there. There's Howard taking a picture in there, and then there's the sand dunes, and there's Chris Best desperately trying to get out of it. And yeah, and there's the beach. It's taken us about, about an hour and a half, do you think? Something like that. Yeah, so very nice um, sort of morning stroll, etc. So um, yeah, very good for the sea air. And only just the best, one of the funniest bits of the holiday so far. So let me show you. I wish I'd videoed it. So we obviously had walked down there and around. So to get back to this bit, we needed to cross this little bit of estuary and um, just hysterical. So we've waded without our socks across this bit, which is where Howell told us to go. If we'd gone across the little bit, it's much shallower and only sand. This is full of rocks. Well, at one point, Howell... Steph, Liam and Griff were knee deep. Griff was being dragged along, oh, honestly, weak, absolutely weak. And then we came round the jetty and back up and we're just sat here now, having dried our feet off, but genuinely one of the funniest bits of the holiday. Good morning and welcome to the final day. It's that time of day where couples divorce and all sorts of badness happens. It's packing time, sad times. There's our car. Uncle Howell's car, Griffith. Good morning, Griffith. <laughs> and there's Liam. So yeah, so what I thought I would little do is just give you a very quick tour of the um, of the house. So I'll turn it around and sort of uh, start. So we've got a really big driveway here, big enough for sort of five five cars here, and then you've got a front door and a patio, and outside here. We've got a really nice sort of seating area and some grass area for the kids as well, which is lovely. So I'll take you in this way. Oh, good morning, Erin. Having a breakfast of uh, 
Walker's crisps. So into a really nice big kitchen diner. Huge dining table. Utility with washing machine, tumble dryer, etc. there. Huge big kitchen here. Everything you could need, apart from when we arrived, there was no wine bottle opener, which is always a disaster. Cooker, big American fridge with loads of space. So yeah, so this fits 10. There was 10 of us and it was more than uh, adequate. So yes, yeah, so you've got the door where we came in here. First of three sort of living areas. So you've got that one in there. Come round. The so utility sort of has two doors, so loads of space in there where we kept everything. We've got the main front door here, and then off here, you had a room, another sort of lounge with a pool table. So Erin and you spent loads of time in here. I'll just put the light on. Another living room in here. So again, Erin and you and use this as sort of a movie room. And I should say there's another one of these TVs in the kitchen. So loads of TVs. And then handily, a downstairs loo and shower. So with 10 of us and three bathrooms, it was really good. So back into the hall, plenty of space for your shoes and stuff from the beach. And then let's just head upstairs. Excuse the chaos because there is loads happening. <laughs> People are desperately hiding, so they're not on the vlog. <laughs> so we'll come up, we'll take a left. We'll start in here first. So, you had a room for four, single beds in here. So this ended up as Erin and Ewan's bedroom. But yeah, four single beds, we stripped all the beds this morning. So yeah, nice big mirror. Chris hiding. <laughs> Loads of space there. We'll head out. So that had four single beds. <coughs> Stairs here. I'm probably going to bump into staff. This is the sort of master bedroom in here then. I'm not sure the big touch. <laughs> with, with an ensuite. We pulled straws for the ensuite. <laughs> Steph doing the bed, another double bedroom. And then we'll head around here. So another double bedroom in here. Loads of good wardrobe space in all of the bedrooms. Head along the corridor. Another double bedroom. Again, with loads of space. And then this was the really cool little bedroom that the boys had. So you had two double, two single beds, sorry. And then in here, excuse the fact that we've been stripping all the beds and just giving the little holiday cottage people a bit of a help really and then in there is like a little playroom with loads of toys and then look it's got like little windows and doors and stuff so they absolutely love to be in this room and having a room of their own so yeah so that was the sort of kiddies room and then finally was the main bathroom which is huge <laughs> full of all the dirty towels but yeah, huge big double shower, lovely jacuzzi bath, toilet, and sink. Yeah, so that's that's been our home for the last seven days, and it has been perfect for us. Yeah, so that's our house tour.